Hello, my friends, and welcome to something a little new. This is the demo of Dungeon Renovation Simulator. We're going to start right here, and then I'll talk more about this. We'll just start on whatever the first level is. So for those of you that don't know, as far as I can tell, this game's similar to something like a Viscera Cleanup Detail. Almost like a Power Wash Simulator, but less Power Washy. What is this thing? Some sort of portal? Okay. So I don't know anything about this except that it's coming out in a few months, I think. There we go. Oh. Now this is the demo. So this will probably open up this other room. How do I use this? Uh, I've got a skull. I've got a longer skull. I think this is a mop. Yes, it is. Look at that. So I don't know what this one is. And then a bucket, which I can set down. No? Ah, yes. Okay. Okay, so this is going to be very similar to Viscera, which I assume means that my weird tentacle stick is going to get dirty. So it does have the nice, kind of locks your camera into place and you can swing your mop around. That's That reminds me of more of a power wash simulator. Oh, I think I'm making a mess. Yeah, I think this is messy. Yeah, okay, so whenever it gets messy, it leaves like a goop. Good to know. And if my feet get dirty, then I leave dirt around as well. So yeah, okay, so that's already dirty again. Let's clean the area around the bucket. And if this is like viscera, then I can probably, yeah, I can knock over the bucket and it makes a mess. So now, what do I do with the- oh. Oh. Okay. I don't know what to do. So I can pick these up and chuck them around, but I can also use this magic skull. Does this hurt? I can use this to create like a vortex. Oh, I'll bet. Do I have to put these in the portal? I do. So does that mean if I set down the portal here, does it just open a new- No. And now I can't see in here. Oh, this is bad, isn't it? Unless there's a way for me to clean this, I summon my portal. So unless there's a way for me to clear out that mess down there, we might be in trouble. Let's explore a little bit before we start doing too much. Also, I'm gonna turn off the music. So I guess my music just hadn't saved. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> Alright, let's explore. So I can't get into here, can I? There's like a spirit in there. Spirit. Alright, so I'm probably looking for a key, and then can I get over here if I just kind of skirt the edge there? What is that? A bit of apple peel, a helmet, ah, a key. So if we're lucky, this opens up this door. Alright, hello spirit. What are you? Oh, I picked it up. It's a crown. How do I equip this? Can I throw this into the portal? I have no idea what I'm supposed to do. What if I put it in the water? I no, didn't like that. Where are you going? What if I put you in here? Oh no, he doesn't like that either. Okay, well he's just gonna bounce around over here. Yeah, I don't know what to do about that. Oh, if I fall in, I can't get across. So you have to... I don't know if that's cheating. But you have to walk across like that. Can I turn this on? No. Oh. Pull that lever. Oh, there we go. That's gonna make that a lot easier. Good. How do I get rid of these cobwebs? Ah, that's what this is for. Only some things can be sucked. So this is primarily for cobwebs, obviously, then. Oh, jeez. We got another mess down there. I gotta find a way to flush that out. Wanted. Hair. True. And then, did I check this one? Was I able to get in here? This one just looks like something sad has happened. Alright. So aside from that door at the start, I don't see any other... ...real ideas of, of other areas to go. And this might just be the exit, like you might just not be able to pull this and then that's just the end. G. What does G do? G highlights dirt. I see. I've got magic dirt vision. Oh, look at this. So we can suck all the cobwebs off the ceiling. That's gonna make this dungeon a lot nicer. So I can keep this on. But I don't know. I don't know if it, <laughs> this is as... Immersive. Can I just... 
Did I knock that over? No. Okay, good. I'll deal with my footsteps in a little bit, and then also... I guess I'm gonna have to deal with bringing... All of this junk to the portal, unless there's some other way for me to open up the portal nearby. I don't know what that thing wants. He's gone. For an adventure. Oh, I can fix the- oh wait, I dropped it. Fix. Oh, okay, that just lets me rotate things. Ah, uh, okay, so I can... grab and throw things. Oh, is that too big? Please, please go back. Okay, I might need to find some way to break this one. Can this one go in there? Yes. Whoops. But for some reason, this one can't. Maybe it's just because it's too big? What if I rotate it a little bit? No, it doesn't want to go in. Okay. So down there, that's a big- that's a mystery. I don't know what I'm supposed to do about this. And I'm worried that if I clean all this, and then I have to go down there, that's gonna make a mess. Why is this green whenever I highlight it? Is this dungeon gear that I'm not supposed to get rid of? You know what, it doesn't show up as dirt. So I'm thinking it's not dirt. Can I use this? Some sort of witch's broom. No, that's orange. I think orange is dirt, but I'm gonna... Uh, now it's green. Well, I don't know. Alright, we'll put all these skeleton pieces over here. Beautiful. Physics. So if I do this, they all get sucked in. Okay, that's good. Realistically, I only have to throw things kind of near the portal. And they get sucked in. What is this? Just a rusty pot. I'm just gonna assume that... Anything that's green and doesn't show up as trash whenever I use my trash vision... Doesn't have to be disposed of. It is a shame that I can't take this and put it somewhere else, unless I can. No. I think there has to be a circle on the wall. So is there one over here? There is. So we can make use of this spot. Is that gonna suck in all these boxes? I don't know if this is garbage. No. Okay, so that's why it doesn't go in. I understand. So these, like I might need to stack these later and put them out of the way, although they are dirty. So these need to be cleaned as well. We got these bits of whoever this was. So we're gonna also need some sort of room to deal with cleaning up objects, I think. Alright, it eats the fruit, so I'm just gonna assume that it can, or that it wants it. Okay, well, I mean, if it, if it eats it, it eats it. I think that's the rule that I'm gonna go with here. If it if it will take it, we'll let it take it. And if I wasn't supposed to, uh, I'm new here. Okay. So if you get them right, it'll take them. So we don't actually have to clean these boxes. That's great news. Oh, or these barrels. Okay, you know what? Basically what I'm hearing here is if it's not nailed down, just throw it into the black hole. We'll let somebody else deal with it. And if we get in trouble, then we'll know for next time. What is this? Plate. Come on, send it to the... to another dimension. I 
I wonder why I can't take this. Why do you not want that? You took- you ate a whole table. Unless this is actually meant for me to collect things in. Where did I find that, though? Okay, I'll make use of it. Uh, this- this thing here, I'm just gonna throw this to the portal. Right now, because I don't know what it is, and it looks big. I need to find out what happened to all the things that I threw down here. Can I see them? Oh, I can. I can use my magic vision here. Okay, never mind. I'm not as worried about the moat as I once was. I am worried that there is another basket down here. And whatever you are. I don't know what that is. Okay, that gets eaten. You, little crown. I'm gonna need you to just stay over here. Just chill here. Alright, we got a pot with a carrot in it. That's nice. Apple core. And again, don't know if I need to dispose of these, but... If the greedy portal will eat it, I will feed it. Oh my gosh, picking up this thing is terrifying. Oh no, I've lost a bunch of stuff. You know what, it's probably better than walking each individual thing out. So, we're gonna continue to use this to our advantage. As best as we can. Perfect. I cannot wait to finish this and then have some notice be like, you threw away all the dungeon equipment, therefore you fail the level. And then we'll know. And we'll know on the shortest level. I'm glad that we didn't start with one of the long ones to try to stretch this out. I don't even know how many levels are available in the demo. This might be the only level. It might just be that you can't even pick the other ones. Who knows? All I know is that I'm looking forward to this coming out because I like these kind of games. Because these are the kind of games where we can just... We can hang out and have a little conversation. And I can talk about... I'm cleaning up the dungeon. I'm putting things inside of this bucket. And you can just think... Oh, jeez. You can think about how... Uh, I'm making a, a worse mess than when I got here. This is the, this is the worst day. I've already... I don't even know what happened. Physics? What is this? Unreal Engine? I think it is, actually. It might be... I, I actually might be Unity. I'm not sure. Either way, we've got physics. I hope that wearing this dirt hat isn't, like, alerting some wraiths or something of my presence. Was there anywhere else that I could put that portal? I don't think so. And also, depending on what people think of this, maybe we do a playthrough of Viscera? Maybe we do a playthrough again of Power Wash Simulator or a stream. Maybe we do a stream. Could be. Could be a stream game. The kind of game where we just shut our brains off. Make things clean. Just chit chat. These are the games I love. Play games to shut off my brain. Thank you. All right, I think this is the last of the things that can be picked up in there. So what I'm going to do, unless I can take this. No, I'm going to take the portal or the black hole, or whatever this is. We're just gonna quickly tidy up what the last of over here is. Can I just throw that there? Yeah, I can. All right, we'll do these one at a time. Wait, what is this? A spoon. Yeah, maybe we do, maybe we stream this when this game comes out. I don't know, we'll see. You know, I haven't done a stream in a long time just because it's just been so focused on getting videos out for things like City Skylines. Okay, so it looks like it's saying there's no more trash, but since I've already committed to throwing a bunch of this stuff out that isn't trash, I feel like I need to finish the job. And I want to take one last walk down in that moat as well and see if there was anything else in there. I do like that I can just turn on my garbage vision, but I feel like is it dangerous? Am I gonna am I gonna disturb some sort of beast. Oh, I tried to throw that in the pot and I just chucked it. 
So we'll come deal with that later. I don't know what it is. A piece of corn? A piece of wood? What is this? A cork? What's it made of? Cork. What is this? Bread? Some kind of bread? Pick up the rest of these. Little cobwebs. Get all the vacuuming done. Suck these up into our little sc a hand skull. Where else are they? My dirt meter was a little bit down, and now it's back up again, and I think it's because I've made so many footprints that I've actually made this just as bad as when we started again. I don't know what I'm supposed to do about this. Oh, jeez. Perfect. Can I go in there? Oh. It almost looks like you can. Wait a minute. I see some sort of, like, weird digital grid. I think you're not supposed to see that. I think I was seeing outside of the level. <laughs> so that's good to know. All right. Best way to do these is to not paint yourself into a corner. So, put that over there. We're gonna start working out from this door here so we can summon this bucket of water, get our mop nice and wet, and we'll start cleaning. And I don't think there's any indication of when my mop is dirty aside from it makes other things dirty. So I just need to be aware when I start making dirt like that. Oh, and then I also need to be cognizant of knocking over that bucket. My tentacles are stuck. Well, that is the power of my mop now. Never mind. Okay, luckily, I don't knock it over with the mop. What a cool mop. Oh, it's busted. So I think the secret is to just clean it regularly. Don't let it get to a point where it starts making a mess. Oh, jeez. My feet are still dirty. This mop does not hold much dirt before it needs to be rinsed out. But that's okay. Knowing that is going to make this a little bit easier. I'm making a mess again. Cool. I like how the tentacles can get stuck. Little bug there. The developers are watching. Oh my gosh, I'm dirty already. I'm sure they're aware. Wow, that is... That is dirting. What is C? C is aim mode. Oh, I see. Okay, so I can go to Viscera style. Or I can use that style, which is more of a power wash simulator style where your camera locks. It's ideal, actually, to lock the camera like that, I think. It's less nauseating to watch, especially during a time lapse, which I'm sure I'll be utilizing here. I'm not sure if that bucket of water can get too dirty and need to be cleaned, so we'll see. I'm going to try and use it until it stops working as I intended. Until it stops working as expected. You have to be careful when walking backwards. Last thing I want to do is spill that. Oh, there's a... Let's press escape. Oh, that's just for this. How to play. Grab a trash. Approach the slime. Do not eat. Vacuum. So you can vacuum slime? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Press to approach the slime. Is that this slime? Am I supposed to suck this up? I don't think so. No, there's no chance. It's gonna be wild in VR. <laughs> oh, I'm making a mess. I might not be able to clean that any more than I already have. Waiting for the mop to. I'm waiting for the bucket to make my mop dirtier, because that's the. That's kind of the viscera style, and it's not happening. So maybe that doesn't happen. I think we found the point where it happens. I take back everything I said about it not happening. It happens. In this rock pile cleans like the most annoying part. 
I don't know what to do about that. It doesn't seem to go away no matter what I do. I'm gonna assume I can't. Is that my arm? What am I? <laughs> I'm some sort of mopping demon. Oh my gosh, it's messy. I'm going to be falling down here anyway. I may as well do whatever cleaning I can. Alright, let's see if I can manage to not kick this over. I think it's also inevitable that I'm going to leave footprints every once in a while, so I'm not going to be too meticulous about them. I might even leave them for last if I notice that I'm making them. I say that, but odds are I'll probably end up cleaning them anyway. What is my mop stuck on? Why can't I clean that? I'm just not close enough. Fair enough. I think I just need to accept that these tentacles are going to get stuck. You know what? It's fine. Don't worry about it. I also don't know what to, how to clean that. I can assume that's clean. And that it's some sort of glitch. We'll come back to it if we need to. Alright, that's one side down. Now we got this side room over here. Again, still don't know if this bread and stuff needs to be disposed of, but we are we are doing it. We are disposing of it. Like, eventually, the dirt has to wear off of my shoes, right? I can't be tracking mud forever. Alright, it looks like that side is clean. Again, I don't know what this does. I can't pull it. That must be how we exit whenever we're done. I'm gonna take our portal and just toss it over there. I also don't want to have to backtrack any muck anywhere, so I'm going to do this real quick. Oh, we're making a mess. Basically, I want to throw that other... Or I want to walk the other thing back over to the other side, the other bucket, just so we don't have to worry about it. I see that I'm making a little bit of a mess here. I'm doing my best. Mop. I wonder what happened here. You know what? It's none of my business. I should be asking questions. It's a dungeon. What do you think's happened here? I'm just the guy with the skeleton mop that comes and tidies up. I don't know how my shoes keep getting dirty. I'm definitely not stepping in the muck. Or at least I'm being very careful not to. It's going to need to be changed soon, I think. Our dirt meter, though, has gone down quite a bit. So we're doing something right. Ground release my mop. Ah, whatever. Take it. I can see a hole in the wall. I can see the grid beyond the developer world. I can see it. I can see the matrix. Yeah, that's dirty. Nope, oh, splashed a little bit, it looks like, as we moved that bucket. I think that's just something that happens. Oh gosh. Well, here we go. Alright, I think we got out of that with the least 
the least new mess created. I like my tentacle mop though. It's very cool. Feels cool to use. How did that get messy? Did I just not clean that? I thought I cleaned this. Got an apple core. Uh, that might just be dirt coming in from the other side. <laughs> I think I might just need to go over there and deal with it. I'll deal with my footprints last. I lied. I know I'm, I'm gonna get distracted by them and stop to clean them anyway. I just can't help it. That's a ketchup in this room. Yeah, see, I think I could see all that ketchup through the wall. Oh my gosh, it's very dirty. It gets my mop dirty almost immediately. <laughs> Look at that. It almost turns that little splatter of ketchup into an even worse mess. Trying, just trying to clean it. Room's looking very tidy. Feeling very confident. Also, the dirt meter almost seems to indicate that it's clean. Oh, we're gonna make a little bit of a mess taking this one over here. I mean, I know that this place isn't clean because I can see that there's a whole room. So I'm not leaving until this is clean. I think the game is operating on a premise of clean enough is all I need to get to. So we'll see if this is clean enough indeed. I mean, this certainly feels over clean. I've gone above and beyond. Why is the dirt meter full? Wait, what's happened? Oh, did I bug it out? I don't even know how to finish this. Have I made it too clean, and now I'm being punished? How do I end the job? Okay, so we know we grab trash, throw it into the portal. Use the vacuum to approach slime. I don't know what that means. Is that me? Am I this little goblin? I need to throw, like, clean water on the ground. Climb these? No, what a shame. That would have been cool. Okay, I can't close those. Do I need to bring the portal back? Oh, there's still dirt underneath the portal. Maybe that's the problem. No? Why is that still sparkling? Oh, cool, I can climb it. Oh, I see some. I mean, if you had to ask me, I'd say this is perfect. Is there maybe no wind condition yet in this demo? You know, I'm going to quickly check Steam. Well, it's possible that there is simply no wind condition. <laughs> and in that case, I'm going to say I won. I don't know what to do with this crown. It's a mystery. There's not, there seems to be no other explanation for what I'm supposed to do. What if I take this to the hair poster? Oh. Oh. Oh, I can go in here.
Oh, this is dirty. Or is it? Money. Oh, is this the slime that I'm supposed to vacuum? I don't know. I found... I found a new room and I don't know what to do in here. I can't mop it. There's money. Yeah, I don't know. Aside from the footprints that I dragged in here myself, this doesn't seem to be a room that's dirty. These are sparkling, but I can't do anything with them. As far as I can tell. Can't interact with them. Okay, well, that's cool. I'm just gonna go throw this into the portal and... I'm gonna say I'm done, because I don't know what else to do. And I don't know how to get it to say, congratulations, you won. I can go in there, but I can't do anything. Oh wait, I am mopping more. Am I mopping more, or am I making a mess? I think I'm- I'm- oh, I'm making a mess. I'm putting slime down. Okay. I think that means that I can clean in here. Uh, a little bit. But some of that brown doesn't mean it's dirty. So that's extra confusing. Alright, I guess thanks for joining me. We'll see if we can play the next level. And if we can, maybe I'll do another video, but I think that's all that I can do here. Whoop, that just made a mess. As far as I can tell, there's no way to actually end what I've done here. So yeah, thanks for watching. If you've enjoyed this, hit the thumbs up button, leave a like, leave a comment, let me know what you think. And as always, if you're new here, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and turn on the bell for notifications. I think I'm done here. Alright, goodbye for now. We'll see if we do the next level or if we're going to wait until the game releases. But this game scratches an itch for me, so I'll probably end up playing this on release, uh, regardless of how many people are watching. Alright, thank you for joining me. I appreciate you being here. Goodbye for now.